everybody. Uh, welcome back to Nanny's Reborn Nursery. And uh, as I told you all yesterday, I'm going to try to work this week on um, changing out some of my sweet babies um, from all of their winter warm clothes into some summer things. But yeah, anyway, let's get started. Uh, for all of you that don't know, this is the this is my Maddie sculpt by Bonnie Brown, and um, I named her Annie after my grandmother. But yes, this is Annie, and she is very she's a very heavy girl, very heavy little girl, and so she's hard for me to move around. I don't I don't uh, do videos with her a whole lot, and I. Pretty sure that's just pretty much the reason why. She's a beautiful girl. I mean, she really is. I, I adore this baby. But like I said, she's really heavy and very awkward. She's hard to, she's hard to change. I think my Grayson is almost easier to handle than what she is. She's just really, really heavy. Not sure what she weighs. I can't remember. I would have to get out all of her paperwork. And I don't want to drag into all of that. So, yeah. Anyway, um, it, here in Tennessee, it is absolutely miserable today. Um, the heat is just, it's insane. It's crazy, you guys. It's. You, I mean, you just, you can't even breathe hardly. It's so terrible. And my, my best thing that I can do right now is just stay inside where it's good and cool. I hadn't planned on going anywhere this week anyway. And so, yeah, I believe my best bet is just to hang out inside the house. Um, Hubby's gone. I think he's back working in some hay again uh, at a place where he... Another place that he cuts for hay in the summertime. He's got several different places that he um, he cuts at. Yeah, um, Annie has had this outfit on for like a really long time. I can't remember even what month it was that I um, that I put her in this. Can't even remember. But we're going to get her out of these long sleeves, and we're going to put her into something much, much cooler, aren't we, girl? Yeah. It's just too warm for that, that old sweater clothes. I went, out, I went out a while ago to take the dog out, and honestly, I thought I was going to suffocate before I could even get back in the house. Oh, it was awful. I mean, just it's terrible. A lot of people enjoy the heat. They, they love the heat and they like to be outside. But me, I'm an inside girl. I don't like, I'm not outdoorsy at all. Uh, I don't do any gardening. Um, the only person around here that does any yard work is my husband. He does the mowing and weed eating and that's about it. That's all that gets done outdoors. I'm just not a outdoors girl. <laughs> Not at all. Now, if you in the summertime, you give me a swimming pool and some shade and a big old glass of sweet tea, then oh yes, I'll stay outside with you for a while. <laughs> but oh, it's it's brutal out there. I would whole 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 lot rather um, be outside in the winter as summer. But here she is. Here's this big chunky girl. She's got her pink snappy dappy. It snaps to the size of your baby. I really like these a lot. I got these. Um, I got these in. Um, I bought some of them that I got. I got them off eBay, and then some of them I got. Um, I purchased baby. She's head's hanging down. Um, I purchased a baby off of eBay, and there was uh, several of these little snap snap diapers in there, and I really, I really like them. But yeah, she's a big girl, I'm telling you. 
I'm gonna put this on her today. This is gonna kind of coincide and go with um, the farmer's market from last week's um, uh, theme Thursday, and it has strawberry on the bum. So that will kind of, you know, that it's a, cool, a much cooler outfit for Annie, but it's, um, it's also um, a farmer's market type top outfit since it's got the strawberries on it I stay behind off time anymore seems like I can't never get my theme Thursdays when I'm supposed to but yeah my allergies are acting up um, sinus problems <sighs> it's just miserable 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 I don't know where you all are from, but I'm gonna tell you where I'm from, it's it's bad. It's really bad. Um, this might be a little bit big on you, Miss Press. This is a three to six months, and that's what size she wears, but I believe, I believe this one's a little bit big on her, but it still fits her good. I like from I like my babies to have on looser fitting clothes anyway. Ah, oh, she's so cute. <laughs> and I'm not gonna put, it's just too warm. It's too hot. I'm not gonna put, let me raise this up a little bit. I'm sorry. Well, hang on just a minute. I'm sorry. Now, I'm not gonna put any socks or shoes on uh, Miss Pris today because it's just too warm. We're gonna stay nice and cool. Nothing on our arms, nothing on our legs, nothing on our feet. We're just gonna be all comfy, all comfy. <laughs> she is one heavy girl, I'm telling you. But yeah, um, as I was saying, the, the heat, the heat index, the humidity and all of that, all factored in together, not good. It's not good at all. Um, I tried um, what my daughter had um, suggested that I do on leaving um, leaving my um, fixing my phone to where it would stay opened all the time instead of you know after so many minutes or whatever it'll it'll shut down and kind of like go to sleep to save your battery life. Um, she told me to uh, go in and open up my um, phone to where it won't shut down or shut off or go to sleep, you know, whatever. And I've tried that the past two videos that I have done and seemingly it does seem to be somewhat better. I don't know if like when you, um, once the, the phone like goes to sleep or goes into sleep mode or whatever in, you know, battery saving mode, I don't know if that causes the video maybe to slow way down or what I'm not I'm not really sure but at any rate we're gonna we're gonna keep trying it and we're gonna see what happens but yeah uh, it's just a sticky hot day here in Tennessee and um, I'm here by myself and I thought what better time to come in here and do another video for you ladies um, I've got to go and find out what theme Thursday is this week I'm going to try to get to do better on that. Um, but yeah, uh, I hope everybody's safe and hope y'all are doing okay. Um, I'm trying to think of some things to say. I don't really have a lot to say, I don't think. Um, it's just another one of those days. Uh, I've got a ton of housework that I need to be doing. And so far, I've washed some clothes and that's it. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna have to get I'm gonna have to get busy. But uh, I did, ladies. I just wanted to stop by and share uh, my sweet Annie with you guys, and um, let you all see her for a little while. She's got a mess of hair going on here that she does. Let's see if I can't comb it just a little bit with this comb. Um, yeah, she's got some. Some little tats in her hair she's had that hat on for a, some a while and it's just 
kind of got her hair a little bit. Have to be careful using the comb. But yeah, yeah, she's got hat hair. Because, uh, like I said, she has been in that, um, in that sweater hat for quite some time. Since back in the winter. Makes me feel terrible when I overlook my babies like that. But you know how we are. I think everybody does this. You get a few new babies and you have, you kind of lean and, um, focus a little bit more on the newer babies than the ones that you've had in your nursery for some time. You kind of just, you know, uh got a tat in your hair little miss press we've got to get that out um you kind of have a tendency to kind of not you know mess with your your older babies quite as much because you're tending to the newer ones but that's okay say so mommy still loves me <laughs> yes i do i do uh of course this um this sculpt was done uh by my uh, beautiful lovely artist kim williams and uh, I don't know if y'all have checked her out or not, but if you've not, uh, go to reborns.com, check her out. She's She's got a few babies on there right now, and um, they're really, really cute babies and very reasonably priced. So go check her out at the Pied Piper Nursery on reborns.com, and you can also find her on uh, the Pied Piper Nursery on Facebook as well. But yeah, um, a huge shout out to um, all of my Dolly friends. Uh, I hope you all are all doing good. Um, I hope everybody's staying safe and I hope everybody's happy and doing well. But um, I'm just rambling on and I'm not really saying anything anyway. So I am gonna let you ladies go. Um, I do appreciate all of my um, new subscribers. I've noticed I have a few more um, lately and i do appreciate that very much um i've been clicking just hearts a lot on my videos lately because i've gotten behind on answering individual every single individual comment you know that's left and that that takes up time and it's kind of hard it's hard to get to all of that it really is but please do know um that i have seen your comment if i click the heart i have seen your comment and I greatly, greatly, greatly appreciate all of your comments that you leave. It, it means the world to me. And it helps uh, the YouTubers channels grow and um, become kind of more popular within the YouTube community and in the Dolly world. But um, yes, all of your comments, if I heart them, please know that I, I'm not just clicking the heart just to get away from you. I'm clicking the heart because I, I do mean that. I do mean that, uh, that I really appreciate. I appreciate all your comments and uh, your likes and everything. And um, I do appreciate all of my subscribers very, very much. But yeah, um, I guess I'll come back on um, maybe tomorrow and do another video with you all. I'm going to work through this and see how these videos uh, start loading up for me and um, keep my fingers crossed <laughs> that they, you know, that they start uploading better for me. But anyway, God bless you all. Um, take care of yourselves and until we see you again, love you ladies. Bye.